Welcome back! Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, hello, I'm Tara and for today's video, we are going to discuss the basic tips sa paghikilay. Now, as you can see, we have a different pattern today. It's because andito na ako sa store and I was already running late. I didn't have the time to do my brows. So, tingnan niyo naman, hindi pa ako nakapaghikilay. Normally, I can do my brows in 3 minutes or so because it's very simple, very easy. Now, since I get a lot of questions about how I do my brows in a daily, on a daily basis, sorry, may I get a lot of questions regarding how I do my brows on a daily basis, so I decided why not do a video about it and show you guys. So, if you know me, you know that I don't really put too much makeup on my face because it tends to get heavy and I don't like the feeling. So, it's the same goes with my brows. So, I only use one product and this and that is the Nishida Minerals Precise Eye Pencil. In the shade Hazelnut. So, this is absolutely one of my favorite products sa pagkikilay. Now, this only costs 138 pesos. So, in choosing a shade for your for your eyebrow product, um, choose a shade that is closest to your hair color. Kasi, to avoid that contradicting effect, con contrast na, example, black ang hair tapos yung kilay mo is blonde. So, parang pangit naman tingnan. Diba? So, choose a shade that is closest to your hair color for that enhanced look. So, anyway. So, I changed to face over para mas clear yung mga pinagsasabi ko. So, the first thing I do is brush my brows. I don't normally groom my brows except pag kailangan because I like it messy and pushy. Next is I get my Nishido Eye Precise Pencil in the shade Hazelnut and then on the upper part of my brows para mas klaro yung def Sorry. <laughs> para mas klaro yung shape ng aking brows. And then, I like to work on the tip first, extending it a little bit on the edge para mas maganda ang definition ng aking face since brows are there to help define your facial feature. And then, I just um, work my way towards the center, filling in the gaps para mas uh, ma-define yung ating eyebrow shape. I like to put more product from the center towards the edge, towards the tip, para mas again klaro yung definition. And then I just work my way in. And then I don't um, normally put too much product, or I don't touch this part, para may wasa yung box like na shape. There you have it guys, my daily eyebrow routine. Always remember to use a shade closest to your hair color and iwasan natin yung box-like shape para hindi obvious na nagkilay ka because we want our brows to look as natural as possible. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell and share this video to your friends para ma-aware sila paano ba magkilay. I hope you learned a thing or two on this video and hope to see you guys on the next one!